It's 9.21 on the 1st of December and there's a little issue being caused that is uh, contravening royal protocol of my royal titles and my royal patronage. Um, it doesn't just contravene royal protocol, it contravenes civil society principles, it contravenes the democracy and the constitution of this country. There's a little problem with people disrespecting um, Brexit that originated from my work experience, my portfolio, uh, my professional portfolio. There's a little problem with people helping themselves to land that I own, that I haven't permitted them to be taking acquisition or, you know, any authority of, or, you know, with the offences that they've caused against my child and I. So there's a very dangerous matter occurring that has caused civil unrest and disrespect to the Declaration of Human Rights as well, I might add. And I'm a humanitarian for a very long time. So there are people in this community that have been quite slanderous and defamation is very dangerous and it's very expensive. And I'm experiencing very dangerous obstruction. And I'm awaiting since 2017 for the Tusa Child and Family Agency to correct the illegal action of an unlawful care order that took place. So there has been obstruction. There haven't been ombudsmen. I've contacted the TDs of the government. I've contacted the United Nations. I've contacted NATO. And there are people resorting to thuggery, thuggery, basic debased behaviour, common as they come, thuggery for my property and my son. So that's very dangerous if people are claiming to be of superiority and claiming to be of professional standards that they're not living up to. So it'd be really great if those that have a position, a duty, a function, a responsibility, an obligation to my royal titles doing their jobs, it would be really helpful to everybody's futures.